We're going to look at bed mass, which is just an extension of bod mass, which you probably did at primary school. So bed mass just tells us the order in which we must do operations when we've got a whole long, complicated calculation to do. So it tells us we start with anything that's inside brackets and we sort out what's inside the brackets first. Then we work with exponents and your squares and your cubes, those are exponents. Then you work at division and multiplication. They're at exactly the same level, so division, multiplication, either of them. And then you work with the last things, which are addition and subtraction, either of them. Let's do a calculation involving bed mass. So bed mass tells us that the first thing we need to look for are the brackets. We do have brackets here, but there's nothing really to sort out inside the brackets, so we can move on. The next thing we need to look for is exponents. We've got exponents here and over here, so we need to deal with those. 2 over 3 squared is going to be 2 squared, 4 over 3 squared, 9. Then we're not dealing with that yet. We deal with the other exponent, 2 squared is just 2 times 2, which is 4, right. And now we've de dealt with our exponents. Bedmass then tells us we must look for division and multiplication. And if there's both division and multiplication, they're at the same level, so we just work from left to right. So the first thing we're going to do is multiply these two together. And remember when multiplying with a... A mixed number, the best way to do it is simply to change your mixed number into an improper fraction. 4 times 2 is 8, plus 1 is 9, so we get that. And we'll just leave the rest here for now while we deal with that multiplication. So here the 9s cancel and the 4 cancels with the 2, leaving 2 here. And so what you've got left is 2. Then we're going to deal with the division and we know how to divide fractions easily we just flip this and multiply and so what we get here is 2 times 4 which is 8 and 8 plus 1 third is just 8 and a third and if we wanted to we could write that as an improper fraction which is 25 over 3.